Welcome to our home world, human. Lunicus. Code red situation. Do you think the SSI Gold Box engine would have made a hell of a good action platform? Do you think Doom is a good game that gets bogged down with 3D movement, dodging, or other annoying features? If you can honestly answer yes to either of these questions, Lunicus is a game you should look into. Otherwise, Oi! The premise of Lunicus, while not exactly revolutionary, is the best part of the package. The alien nords have been emitting some kind of hypnotic field. In the near future, a group of archaeologists discover alien artifacts in a dinosaur fossil site. The artifacts lead scientists in bold new directions, and the Earth enjoys a period of great prosperity. But when one of the artifacts is repaired and reactivated, it sends a signal across the galaxy. Soon after, an alien warship parks itself over the Earth and sends down nodes that emit hypnotic fields over major cities. The aliens are keeping everyone alive. But for how long? Only the moon-based Lunicus has gone undetected. As a Lunicus pilot, it's your job to stop the aliens and destroy the hypno-nodes. In between missions, you'll wander around the base and talk to people. The voice acting is well above par. Security breach of the complex. But it's only present between missions. Only after you leave the moon base does the game really begin. Once in a mission, Lunicus deteriorates into a silly mixture of an AD&D gold box title and a Doom clone. Whether on foot, in a tank, or whatever, you wander around blasting evil alien ships. What really kills the game is that your movement is entirely step-based, like you're walking from tile to tile. Dodging, walking backwards, and other actions Doom fans take for granted just aren't possible to perform. The cinematics are decent, but they aren't nearly enough to save this game. Do yourself a favor. Read a book instead.